welcome back guys uh, hope you enjoyed my previous videos on a uh, wireless and uh, wireset so in this video we will be using a uh, wireset on a uh, wireless side uh, previously we were, were using on uh, a LAN side so let's just check our card so I don't have a wireless card still let me bring up my wireless card so here you can see I have a wireless card WLAN 0 and before we can start monitoring on a uh, wireless side we must first uh, put our card to a monitoring room. so the command would be mo-ng Zero. So this command will put our card to our monitoring room. So here you can see it can already load up monitoring room. Let's check our card. So here you can see we have another interface and mon zero and monitoring room. So let's just check if we can monitor or not. can see already it is uh, no, mounted in it so here I can see my list up ok so let's launch our whatsapp Okay, so I go on to and when you go to capture over here and see the interface. Uh, you can see here the LAN, WAN and module. So you can select module and click on start. So here you can see number, time, source, destination, protocol, uh, HA2.11, lane, information. So here if you want to use a filter, so I'll be covering some filter option here. If you want to cover a filter is mm, so here we need okay let's go to the this one here see here you can see a lot of SSID I think three three different SS I think two different SSID you can capture side you can see source is one is Cisco Sony mobile Cisco bring back so the mobile I think three different device over here mm. here can put this on the channel Okay, so here you can see a frame uh, frame control is normal and type is beacon frame 
and if you don't want to see a beacon frame here is the beacon info it's a beacon frame so if you don't want to see a beacon frame you can just or if you want to see only the base id of this one so it's a cisco so if my filter and select it so when you see here you can see only a uh, only about a double and basis id is mac address of basis id is this one <coughs> so again if you want to filter with uh, only one specific uh, mac address you can go over here and if you don't want to see a beacon frame you just right click apply filter and not select it so here you don't see any beacon frames over here ok so if you only want to see Okay, let's just clear this filter first. Filter. So if you want to see it then it's any more right? Okay, So here you can see packet coming from there. So you know that. And I don't want to see what you can notice here is SSID is always in a plain text. So uh, whatever whatever you do you cannot trigger SSID. Whether you hide or whatever you do to your SSID it is always visible in it wireless sniffing so mm, here come another device sensor it's probing here is a probe response from a sensor device probe response okay i only want to see if i want to see any subtype filter and select it. so if I selected only a probe response it will show me only the probe response <coughs> probe response means uh, they when before connecting to a wireless device there is always a probe response and probe uh, request so this is the response sent by print back and uh, here is the response sent by uh, Cisco and so on from here to the Cisco to the Samsung I think this one is more like send the response there is no connectivity still because there is no observation and hack and advancement so let's just clear this filter and apply if you want to see only the acknowledgement you can do subtype and just apply filter for this acknowledgement so here you can see only the acknowledgement this is a clear type filter so here you can see acknowledgement to the intel intel sony So actually over here on a uh, okay. uh, actually over here if you want to capture the packet and later use for a uh, uh, key capturing so you could can uh, over just over here and 
put some more option in capture the packet and save save some it so later you can use for uh, the prepare web cacking so maybe on the next video i will be showing you how to crack a uh, whip then after wpa and so on so i think this all for that's all for this video uh, you can go and try uh, more and more and just use a wire for capturing a packet and uh, applying a filter and uh, if you do on it you can get more idea on how to use it and uh, you can do better uh, i think that's all for this video thank you if you have any question or if you want to have any request you can just uh, uh, mail me or you can just make a comment over there i try to do it for you uh, thank you guys thank you for watching see you on the next video